and greetings from PAM, the Pacific Islanders and Asian American Ministries of the UCC. I would like to share with you a message from Jeremiah 29 11, which says, I alone know the plans I have for you. Plans to bring you prosperity and not disaster. Plans to bring about the future you hope for. So as all of you continue on your faith journey, I hope you remember these words. And also I want to share with you who you are is God's gift to you. What you make of yourself is your gift to God. Blessings on the rest of your summer. To all of the youth and young adults of the United Church of Christ, you beautiful people. I call upon the God who created each and every one of you in her image and called you good. I call upon Jesus Christ, God's only Son, our Savior and Redeemer, who showed us the pathways to peace and humanity and shalom. And I call upon their Holy Spirit, who abides with you, to bless you, to embolden you to be courageous voices for peace, unity, justice, and equity, to enlighten you and show you the pathways of justice and to bless you, to keep you safe as you go forth to preach and proclaim the good news of God's transformative and redeeming love to all the world. We have come to the end of another national youth event, a time that affords our youth the opportunity to gather across the settings of the United Church of Christ and be one. This time is a time that is about discovery. It is about your understanding of yourself as youth. It's about your voice. It's about being empowered. And so as you leave out of this virtual space, having been filled with the spirit in so many ways, we invite you to continue to unite to see a just world for all. Unite as one body in Christ. Unite as one spirit filled with hope and courage and boldness to be a witness and agitator for justice. And one mind, one mind in Christ. And so may the blessings of Christ be with you as you go to your various settings and embrace what the divine has gifted you with this week. Hey everybody, I am super excited about your commitment to unite through the extraordinary. These are indeed extraordinary times. And in the work of justice, we meet that extraordinary at the intersection of courage and compassion. Courage to show up courage to show up with those whose voices are being silenced, courage to show up with those who are being marginalized, courage to show up and fight for equity wherever injustice is found, and the compassion to listen, to hear, to see, and to fully understand the plight of others. At this intersection of courage and compassion, we find out we are not alone. And I am so grateful to stand at this intersection with all of you. God bless.